Everybody has secrets to tell. My secrets are bigger than others. Can you understand that whatever we discuss here doesn't leave this room? Of course. The president has asked me to look into creating a foreign intelligence service. My orders came through. I'll be going overseas. What are you going to do, Edward? Save the world? I'll do what I can. Welcome to our little clubhouse. You're going to have to learn the English system of intelligence. I'm here to see a tailor. How is the fishing? Set the mongoose free. Gentlemen, the CIA. And the nasty little secrets. No matter what anyone tells you, there'll be no one you can really trust. The non professionals best that way. How do I know if I can even trust you? You can take the gloves off. Tell me your real name. We don't have to be gentlemen anymore. What is your name? You're the guys that scare me. You're the people that make big wars. And we make sure the wars are small ones. First opportunity you boys get, you're going to be breaking and entering like thieves in the night. Margaret tells us that you work with the CIA. My wife has a vivid imagination. You are never to tell anyone what it is that I do. What you do? I don't know what you do. You leave at five, you're home at ten, seven days a week. I live with a ghost. I don't know anything about you. Why is it that people like us choose to serve for nickels a day in a profession that makes us continually look over our shoulders for who's watching us? It isn't about dedication and loyalty. It's about belief in what we do. I never even met my little boy. Are you Edward? We don't have to be like this, you and I. We don't have to be strangers. Remember what I said to you about friends? Get out while you still can, Edward. Why do you still have a soul? The Good Shepherd.